Well, good morning and welcome to coffee. And devotion with Pastor Mike. Today, February the 2nd, greater works. Most assuredly, I say to you, he who believes in me, the works that I do, he will also do. And greater works than these he will do, because I go to my father, John 14, 12. The CEO of a company spends three months with a small team setting up a new field office. Then on a Friday afternoon, he announces he is returning to the company's headquarters. He is leaving the operation of the new office in their hands. What he tells them makes sense. There's only one of me and a dozen of you. You will accomplish more as a team than I could ever accomplish here on my own. And I'll always be on a, be only a phone call away. In a partial way, that's what Christ communicated to the disciples before he returned to heaven. The greater works he said the disciples would do in his absence didn't refer to greater miracles, but to a greater scope. As the apostles began to spread the gospel and the church began to grow, Christ would be revealed to the whole world through the power, Acts 1.8, gifts, 1 Corinthians 12, Romans 12, and fruit, Galatians 5, 22 and 23, of the Holy Spirit. Christ has equipped the church to be his head, hands, and heart in the world. When the world sees Christians, they are to see the life and character of Christ, John 13, 35. Today, when others interact with you, what are they seeing? Ask God to reveal Christ through you to the world. Peace and blessings.